Issuance and verification of one or multiple verifiable credentials with a great user experience and many options to customize. That's what you get with the new all-in-one portal by WorldID. Up to date with the latest OIDC standards, proven interoperability with other identity solutions on the market, and the option to add your own custom credential with just the click of a button. You can use it to launch any kind of end-to-end -end identity solution faster, whilst being able to match it to your look and feel. Although it is not yet publicly available, you can already try it out online and play around, and reach out to us in case you'd be interested in the solution pre-launch. With that said, let's jump jump into a quick demo and see everything in action. I already have the WorldID portal up and running and here is a list of credentials which you can issue right away. And all of that is scattered from our credential marketplace where you can easily also make a pull request and add new ones or even just come here and click this button and paste any compliant W3C credential data structure and save it and the credential will be created and then after that you can issue it. Okay, let's now see how we can issue ourselves a credential using this portal because basically you can select how how many credentials you want and then start the issuance based on that. And then here we have a full customization page where you basically can also configure certain security settings for the OADC protocol from a pre-authorized check mark or a required user pin and as well as do later on a verification of those two credentials and selecting or configuring the policies that should be checked. Okay, let's first now issue ourselves those two credentials into our wallet. And here I could just use any interoperable wallet and scan this QR code and issue it to. I will now just open it in our web wallet and receive the credential. Once I have those two credentials in the wallet, I can come back to the portal and do a verification where I now select a bank ID, click start, and then configure my verification. Here I will also now just open it in the web wallet and accept the request. Here we see the credential that was presented as well as the data which is in the credential. We can also view the whole JSON data as well. At the bottom you see the different signatures which has been verified. Now you have seen a general overview of what you can do with the new portal. And the great thing is you can customize it completely to your needs. Change the branding, the styling, as well as different pages if you only need to issue a portal or a verifier portal. Make sure to check out the link in the description to get started and try it out or reach out if you want to get access pre-launch. Happy building and see you next time.